Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. In this video, we're going to look at Sword Burst. And it is a cantrip from the Sword Coast Adventurer's Guide for Sorcerers, Warlocks, and Wizards. It says you create a momentary circle of spectral blades that sweep around you. All other creatures within 5 feet of you must succeed on a dexterity saving throw or take 1 die 6 force damage. This spell's damage increases by 1 die 6 when you reach 5th, 11th, and 17th. Again, it's the typical scaling we see in most of the cantrips. If you want to see exactly how the scaling works, video 14 explains it in detail, and I'll put it in the description if you want to see exactly what it's doing. So I already have this done. We're going to be doing the using the default template, and then name equals sword burst. That's the title row, and then we're going to have three rows in the table. So the first row, every row ends in a double set of braces. So the first row is going to say range all creatures within five feet of the caster. And then the second row is going to be a DC spell save, a dexterity save, and we're going to go get Kiara as our wizard. And if she's casting it, then we have to go get her spell save DC, which is on her spell tab of her character sheet, in which case I know it is a 17 at this point. And then the last row we're going to do damage. And I'm just putting these back together because you can't separate them like that and run it. So then you'll have force damage. And this is our scaling syntax here again. I'm not going to do great detail. Basically, it's going to roll a 1 die 6. And then at level 5, it's going to add one. At level 11, it's going to add another one. Level 17, is going to add another one based on Kara's level. So it'll scale with you once you put this macro in into place. You don't have to ever touch it again. So let's run this. And so we got range all creatures within 5 feet of the caster. So basically, you're doing a spinning blades around you. It's a DC 17 dexterity save, so every creature that you hit has to make a dex save. And then there's five force damage, not on a save. So it's an all or nothing spell. And this is scaling correctly because Kiara is currently level nine. She gets one die six at level one, and then another at level five, which would be two die six. And then again, at 11, but she's not 11 yet, so two die six is correct. So it is scaling correctly. I will put this in the description below with the same caveat with this less than sign. I can't put that in the description in YouTube. I, so I put it in like this, less than sign. And then I put a note up at the top. It says change less than sign to an actual. So when you copy and paste this into your macro, you're going to change that to that. So and that's it. Hopefully that helps. I appreciate you watching. Have a great day and we will see you on the next one.